quite often we're asked, why would a future society bother to bring back cryopreserved patients? Now I think that question is a misconception. It implies that we are relying on other people to do the work. In fact, Alcor will bring back Alcor's patients. For one thing, it's part of Alcor's mission statement. If you look on the webpage at our mission, you'll see that the last point is exactly when it becomes possible to repair and revive our patients and to help them reintegrate into society. Secondly, there's a contractual obligation here. Our members pay us money and sign contracts, and our end of that is precisely to keep them cryopreserved and to bring them back when, when that technology arrives at some point in the future. In addition, there is a duty of the Patient Care Trust Fund to do exactly that. The Patient Care Trust Fund is administered by a separate board of directors and is really run separately from Alcor and protected from anything that might happen to Alcor. A big chunk of the money that you pay us to be cryopreserved after we've paid for the surgery and the chemicals and everything else that's used in the procedure is put into a separate trust fund and we never then touch the capital from that. We simply use the earnings generated to pay for liquid nitrogen and other costs of upkeep for decades if necessary. Now since we don't touch the capital over decades, and it probably will be decades, compound interest will increase the amount of that fund. So when it does become possible, if it becomes possible at some point in the future to revive people, we should have quite a large amount of money to pay for that procedure. Plus, if you think about it, many technologies, especially those driven by computer technology, which is increasingly a larger range of the whole economy, tends to reduce prices over time. So eventually, the cost of repair and revival should go down, even if we didn't have huge pots of money available. And finally, Alcor is a community of people. So this is not just something we promise to do as an organization. We're doing it for us. It's not they who will bring us back, it's us who will bring ourselves back. We have loved ones and friends and relatives who are cryopreserved, and we want to bring them back. When we bring them back, they will have other relatives and friends from earlier also cryopreserved, and they will want to bring them back too. So it's a very personal matter for us. There's no us and them. We will do this for ourselves. I'm Max Moore. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, share it with your friends, and visit the Alcor website.